Hi, it's John Costa Mesa R&D. Uh, today we have a small block Chevy in the shop that we're going to check for pinholes. Customers complained of having the oil pan fill up with water and uh, not losing anything out the radiator or the overflow. So we're going to pressure test the block and see what's going on. You can see this is a fairly heavily modified small block. The guys went to all the trouble of polishing out the valley and so anyway like I said we're going to check this out and see what we've got. Okay, we've got about 55 pounds of air in there and you can all actually see the thing starting to drop down. So we'll take and squirt a little bit of soapy water on here to kind of see what's going on. Actually, see down there in the number seven, about halfway down, right there in the middle of the screen, you can see where the thing's actually leaking. Let's check over here. You can see we got a little bit of a leak here between the deck plate and the uh, block, but that's all right. That's cylinder five. This is cylinder three, looking pretty good here. And then we get over here to number one, you can see where it's also leaking about midway down the cylinder. So it looks like we have a dead player here. Uh, we'll get busy and check the other side and see what it needs on that side. Well, looking at the other side here, we don't see any signs of leakage except between the gasket and the uh, torque pipe which again is not a problem, but we don't see anything in the cylinders. So, what we have here is a dead player. Now, whether the customer will want to take and put a couple sleeves in this, we don't know yet. We'll get a hold of them and find out. Anyway, for more information about pressure testing, non-destructive testing, this is John Edwards at Costa Mesa R&D. See you soon.